You take one step into St. Vincent de Paul's Central Kitchen and you notice that's a lot of food. They come in, they chop, slice, dice, prep food. Joining the 15 cooks and dishwashers day in and day out at the largest commercial kitchen in the Southwest, around 25 volunteers. Our, our base is volunteers. We couldn't do anything without our volunteers. Every day this kitchen feeds about 8,000 people because well, just read the shirt. Yeah, that's so every morning at 3 a.m., the Central Kitchen wakes up and they literally start preparing food because they need to feed families and individuals every single day. So they actually are loading up all of this food and they need it to deliver to four of their dining halls and also 30 of their partner social service agencies. Making salad bowls and we're going to do about 1,500. Oh my, today? A lot of these people don't have places to go, so they go to our, our dining rooms. Some of them, a lot of them are staying at our shelters. And um, it's so important to make sure we, we feed these folks. However, with the holidays upon us, a little extra volunteers to make a little extra food doesn't hurt. I mean, we thrive every day with what we do, but the holiday season, Thanksgiving and Christmas, is really when we shine. This kitchen goes above and beyond to feed its community with a two-week rotating menu and is thankful for all the help they can get. Um, even though we have the holiday, Thanksgiving, every day is Thanksgiving because every day we have to be thankful for what we, what we have. In Phoenix, Troy Lynch, 12 News.